all right guys good morning today we're gonna go uh, do a review and uh, plan a, a route on uh, my drive for the um, TomTom Tom 500 550 okay so let's start first uh, put your login information so you can log in all right and put your country and everything and all the details you want to do here and go to root planner uh, road trips is something else that uh, you can go here and uh, uh, do a search and everything on uh, tom tom website we're not going to go through this right now uh, we're going to plan our own route okay so <clears throat> Um, first, I'm going to do a, a quick introduction on the my drive, just in case you are a newbie. All right. <clears throat> All right. So I'm going to show you uh, how I'm going to be working on uh, planning a, a, a route. All right. I'm doing it a different way. So if I know where I want to go, example. All right. Uh, what I do is I also use uh, Google Maps right here okay I'm gonna show you how I do it now first let's look the uh, the, the my drive all right here basically you search for an uh, for an address uh, let's search for uh, let's say uh, Alexandros uh, Alexandros and he gives you all kind of uh, uh, recommendations right here. This is uh, this is Attica. Attica is the region, and this is Athens in the center, and this is uh, uh, Piraeus, the harbor. Okay, so you can see here if you put a number like let's say uh, forty-three something like that, it will give you recommendations here. You can find the address uh, quicker. All right. So when you look in the map. You see some things here. This is some stars. This is places that I have. Uh, these are my bookmarks, actually. Okay, on the on the map right here. Uh, so this can be your bookmarks. Uh, example: This is uh, Kitherol. This is the place in Thiva will go fly, or will go for a ride. All right. It is also if you zoom on the map, it will give you traffic. You see the red spots here. Traffic this way. Traffic this way. Traffic the other way. Light traffic is a different color. It's not red. It's uh, orange. Okay, and so on. All right. This is the airport example. So you know this is the center of the city. So the more you zoom, okay, the more traffic you get. And this is goes on the uh, on the on the GPS on your uh, bike. All right. Or if you take it in the car, whatever you want to do with it. Um, so. Let's go to the next uh, section. All right, so let's say you see the traffic here, you see your bookmarks and everything, and uh, you want to see what's this here, here right now, right? So let's go to an area that's not that busy, and let's click the, uh, the first one. The first one, of course, is hotels, all right? It also gives you a picture, and it gives you the stars and the ratings. <laughs> it's amazing, right? Let's go to a place here that uh, not too many. All right, so let's go here. All right, so you can see this has uh, not even three stars. All right, and uh, it's another one. So this is direct from a, a, a TripAdvisor right here. These ratings. All right, so when you look on the map, you, you know, you see exactly where you want to be getting and plan your uh, uh, your route all right and uh, you see that you can just plan plan a route right here or add to my places send to device just drive right there or you can start from here all right you can read the reviews it's amazing what they have integrated into the my drive all right i love it and uh, let's go to uh the next one, all right, and uh, the next one is right here. Let's see what that is. TripAdvisor again, 
Okay. Uh, place of interest. This is a beach. All right. <clears throat> That's a monastery. Okay. What's the year? Uh, laser games. I don't know what that is. Anyway. But anything is on TripAdvisor. And if you zoom, it will probably give you uh, uh, more. All right. You see that? Archaeological uh, site of, uh, of uh, Isthmia. The Corinth Canal. Right here. It's right from TripAdvisor and it also have a picture, okay? It's amazing that you can just, you know, plan your... Uh, you don't have to go back and forth from Google to do that, all right? It's right here. All right, so <clears throat> basically another thing is the third one. The third one is restaurants, all right? The Barbatasos, Ancotasos, okay? It has... Uh, Four and a half uh, uh, stars rating, uh, 67 uh, reviews. You can pr click on it and uh, you will open here. You can read some and click here and close it. All right. So everything is here, as you can see. One, two, three. So you don't need you don't need more than that, really. If you want, to, if you need more than that, just go to. Uh, Google Maps and it will give you a uh, hundred more information. All right So then the next one here. So the first one we search for uh, our road or our destination You can also uh, Search for uh, a place of interest. Okay, like if you are in the States You want to go to Costco you just type Costco and it will open Costco near you. Okay example or uh, Home Depot, all right? Um, the next one, it's uh, the Root Planner. We're going to talk about this. Okay, so these are my places, all right? You can, uh, this is the stars you see before on the map here, all right? The, the, the other one is uh, my roots. So you can see here, if, uh, I have already designed some routes. You see that? Check it out. All right. And uh, we use them for uh, our tours and everything. And uh, uh, it's a lot of them. It's hard work. Uh, road trips is uh, recommending uh, road trips from, uh, you know, around uh, Europe, anywhere. You can look on that. And the other one is settings. Uh, you want to change this to miles, or you want to change to meters, uh, <coughs> or miles, feet, pound here, okay? Uh, you can remove traffic. Uh, you can see traffic flow here, the direction, which one is going. And there's another thing here, then it's uh, scenic segments. What about scenic segments, okay? Explore the most scenic drives around you and enjoy amazing views all right you click ok and let's uh, open that check it out <laughs> okay i don't know the, <laughs> how they have done that but <laughs> it it most of them because i'm a tour guide <laughs> for uh, motorcycle tours and, <laughs> and regular tours we do sometimes <laughs> check it out these are scenic drives in Peloponnese, all right, and more and more. This is this is a really good one here. Of course, we design ours too, but and you know we we spend years designing these scenic drives, but they have kind of like figured it out some of them, all right. Okay, let me take a break and I come back and we design a, a route. Okay, I'm back. So. And uh, close the settings. All right. So let's plan uh, a route. Okay. We start from uh, plan route right here. All right. All right. So let's plan uh, a route. Okay. Uh, I'm going to improvise. All right. Let's say we start from uh, uh, Kifisia. Okay. That's like north of uh, Athens. All right, so uh, use a starting point right here. All right, let's use that. 
remove that and we have uh, our starting point right here all right now um, we're gonna go uh, we want to go away from the city and uh, but uh, first we want to see the marathon lake okay so we're looking for the lake all right right here okay and uh, you can put uh, this this is the viewpoint here okay you can uh, plan a route on that all right so it goes automatically and it gives you uh three routes you see that oh hi okay you see it gives you a fast route all right that's the light blue right here you you, you go through the highway and everything and uh, gives you the first scenic route no delay okay that's the the second one so when you press on that it will become light blue okay you see that all right so this one you avoid also tolls okay and the third one it's another drive if you just want to go through the beach and everything and uh, go all around uh believe it or not this is the one i use i go from here i like it better and uh, this is the third one okay and you can save to my roots or uh, show directions from here what are one direction right now or you can even uh, share route okay it will save it as a file you can just send destination to the tom tom if i press send destination to tom tom Check it out. You see that? Received a new destination. Okay. So we're not going to stop here. All right. We're going to go around. <coughs> Excuse me. And we want to go to Avia Island. You will arrive at your destination at 109 p.m. Okay. We're going to go to Avia Island. And we're going to go all the way to the little islands here. That's a big road. That's like a, a long drive right here. Okay, remember, down here it will give you all the, uh, the information. How long it, uh, the, uh, includes tolls and everything. You can avoid tolls by adjusting it on the, on the GPS. We're going to talk about this a little bit later. But basically, this is your distance, and this is the the the, the time uh, uh, of arrival, and this is how long it will take you. All right. So basically, we want to go to Avia Island, but uh, we don't want to go through the uh, the regular bridge. We want to go through the old bridge. Okay. The other way I can you can do it is just go to Google. It's faster. And go to Avia Island, and you can see there is two bridges here. Okay, one here and one here. This is the old bridge. Okay, and this is the way you want to go. All right. So what you do is you click. Let me zoom a little bit so you can see it. What I do exactly? You can see this is the GPS coordinates right here. All right. How are you going to take that? You click on what's here. And it opens here, and you just go there and right click and copy the GPS coordinates, go back to TomTom Tom and add, enter, and check this out now. You see that? You all set. Not even five seconds, and you are going through that. You don't like the way it goes here, so you just grab that and you put it here. And now you're not going to go through the city, all right? You're going to go to the scenic drive. This is a really good drive. It just goes all around the world and uh, you can see uh, classic buildings and stuff, okay? <clears throat> and the old uh, rail station is right here. 
and the castle. Okay, that you see here, the Garababa castle. It's a medieval castle. All right, so we are finished yet. All right, so we already know um, our distance is 91 kilometers. We're going to arrive, uh, uh, our uh, uh, time to do that is an hour and a half. And you're going, we're going to arrive at 2 p.m. All right, includes toll roads. Again, we can avoid tolls, uh, but we don't want to right now because we want to cross this distance quick, okay? Uh, we pay a couple of bucks, but if you want to, you just go on the GPS on the current route and avoid uh, at, at tolls or whatever, or even construction on the, on the highway, you can avoid that. All right, <clears throat> now let's completely the route, okay? We're going to do a stop in Limni. Limni is a village. Okay, you see Google, it's much faster to do that. Limni is right here. Okay. And uh, let's go to Limni. It's a beautiful place. We have a, a couple of videos of that. We'll, we'll fly the drone. And you should go back and look at it. Okay. And you can even see the, the, the scenic drive. You can even see from the Google what's going on here. You see that? This is the beach. Look at that. Look how many beautiful places. Okay, you can even see the, the, little house, the little village here. This is where we stay, right here on the other side, in the motel. All right? And this is all motorcycle ride. Yes, sir. We have it on video. Look how beautiful this is. Look how beautiful this is, people. This is all scenic drive. And uh, you can see the other side. This is the tavernas. This is where we have dinner, right here. Right here, okay? And what do you want to do? You want to go to direct to the taverna and eat and uh, spend a the day there like that? Okay? Again, go like this. Or we'll go to the hotel. Our, our motel usually is right here. All right, so we go right click. What's here? Copy. Copy GPS coordinates and just add here again and again. Check it out. You see that? <laughs> it's amazing, right? Okay. And now. Hold on, let me drink some coffee. <clears throat> and now we are having dinner and we're going to go to the little islands. Okay, and stay here. You see, it also gives you, if you have these three, uh, these things open, it gives you already the recommendations. Uh, place of interest, right here. Everything is right, right, right where you, uh, right here. If you want to, you know, take them off. But uh, that's the beach bar, you know, we, we already have a couple of drinks here, last year, okay? So, and to the route, you have a choice here. If you know exactly where you're going, just add to the route right here. Or, if you don't want to go there, okay? And uh, you see these little islands here, very beautiful. We're going to go to Cabos, all right? Let's see what's the difference. All right. Let's see here. You see that? That's a little bit far away from where we want to be. We want to be in covers. Okay. So either you go from here, click once, and add stop. Okay. We don't want to stop. We want to add a destination. All right. Or add to my places, use a starting point, add stop, send destination direct to GPS. Okay, so let's see if is uh, how, what is the edge stop is gonna do. <clears throat> you see that? Okay, Lichardos Cabo. Okay, you see that if you edge stop, is different. All right, he place it here. All right, so we we'll have to move this up. Look at the difference now. Now it's correct. 
You see that? Okay, so the other way to do it, of course, is again, right click, what's here and get the GPS coordinates right here. All right. Okay, let's go back. So our route is planned, but we want to do a loop, we'll go home later on. Okay, so add, add, home. We want to go home fast. We don't want to go through all this again. So it gives us the highway and we're right here. All right, we were back home. Okay. All right, so let's take a break and let's see what else we can do with the my drive. Of course, you sent this to uh, save to my roots. Of course, I'm going to save to my roots because I like this one. Let's save to my roots. Okay, I'm going to name it uh, uh, my uh, uh, Evia Iceland. Okay, uh, through Marathon Lake. Okay, just put it like that now. I don't want long names. I'm just cut the Iceland too. Ice, Iceland right here. All right, sync this route <coughs> as a track with my devices. If you don't do that, it will not go to GPS. Okay, sync. Okay, again, the other one option is do not show this again. Show comparable devices. You don't have to do that. Uh, yes, I drove this route. It will share it to the <coughs> community. I don't want to do that. Uh, and you just click save. It says right here is sync it. Okay, if it doesn't say that here then it's not synced to the gps all right so let's see if it's in the gps right now go here go to my roots <coughs> excuse me and we have named it uh, what was it yeah avia so we'll go to e right here you see that okay Okay, and you basically ready to go, all right? So you can do that and plan your routes. And, you know, you can just press right right now. Okay, you can either ride to the nearest point or to the starting point. Starting point. All right, and you kind of are like ready to go, all right? Now, let's see what else is and uh, close that. And all your routes are here. You will arrive at your destination at 1.03 p.m. You hear that? Okay, so we all set. Put it on the bike and go. Um, let me see if there's anything is missing from this information that I just gave you. But uh, usually use both the google maps and my drive it will make your life easier and uh hold on let me close that all right so um on on, on uh, google you can see more details and everything like example uh right here you know i know this place but you can uh, you know see how the road condition is see that this, well, this is what I'm checking, especially when I'm designing a tour, then I haven't go over it or just to go to this place to uh, to check everything before we take the people there. <clears throat> this is what I do. Okay, so then I take roads and we go there and we'll see, look how beautiful this is. So, you know, you see that? Uh, so I hope... Uh, and uh, you know i help you out and if it's anything else i will put it on this video if, if, if something comes to mind and uh, uh, don't forget to give us a like like get us going okay well, this is the motorcycle information uh, highway
all right and check out our channel we have a lot of videos and subscribe all right guys thank you okay uh, my second example it will be uh, to go uh, upstate New York from uh, Queens okay so I have entered the entrance here uh, from Queens we're planning the route right now okay and I want to take Palisades Parkway because it's more relaxing and much safer <coughs> special from uh, for motorcycles than the 87 throughway and it's more green and you have better views and all this kind of stuff is going around the river right here you can see okay and we want to go upstate New York on uh, uh, Catskills towards flying hang gliders all right so let's go let's zoom out again and uh, let me go back to Google leave Greece and fly to New York and uh, where are we yeah right here okay and uh, we want to go through uh, the Bear Mountain right here Hudson River uh, let me see here okay so we are on Palisades <coughs> Parkway okay all right so we want to go uh hold on let me see it uh let's see if i can find it like that ellenville ellenville all right we go to ellenville towards flying hang gliders where i want to go into the town we're going to go to the uh, walkers valley right here this is the this is a viewpoint this is a good lookout okay that's the takeoff right here and uh, this is the parking area so we're gonna go and click on what's here copy that and add enter okay so thrill you want to spend uh, more time going around and see places it gives you the options okay what i have to because i know the way all right and uh, then from Ellenville, we're gonna go to Midtown. Hold on, let me find it. Uh, let me see here. We're gonna go. We're gonna take. Uh, we're gonna go through the town, and we're gonna go to Kerhoxon. Right here. It's a hotel here. You can stay. Um, state park we're gonna go here mountain uh, restaurant okay so we're gonna go to Kerhoxon okay to Don Juan to eat and we're gonna stay in uh, Colonial Hotel uh, Motel all right so again we click uh, uh, this one here add to root all right and then we want to go back home okay back to new york so okay so we add this and we just copy this address here copy it and uh, put it on the bottom here and enter let's see what happened
okay all right so it gives us a, a faster route all right right here so we have a four hour and a half trip okay save to my routes i don't want to save to my routes right now this one okay you can see the traffic here also is visible all right and uh, i'm in athens right now so this is like seven hours back this is very early in the morning uh, this is like uh what it's 12 o'clock here one it's like uh six something in a o'clock in, uh, in new york all right so i hope uh, um you guys uh, i help you out and if you like the video and uh, leave us a like if you want to subscribe subscribe because more stuff about all these interesting things coming up okay and uh, if you have any questions just put it in the comments definitely i'm gonna reply or say thank you something like that thanks for watching